Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Shantae and the Seven Sirens. Last time we left off we had made it to the sunken shipyard and ran into a room that looked like it was going to be an arena fight of some sort. So why don't we go take that on now. Siren, be gone. <laughs> Who said that? I fear you not! I have no life left to take. What is this? You are no siren. I, I'm a half genie. Half genie? Down here? How? And where's your other half? Half genies are daughters of genies. I came here looking for my friends. They were captured by sirens, and now I've got to find them. Can you help me? <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> hmm. Maybe you speak the truth. Or perhaps you lie. A siren trick? One way to know for certain. Be Do a good deed, as only a genie would. Then I'll know you are worthy of trust. Huh? A good deed? Like what? Return my scary doll to me. A precious gift, a family keepsake it was. But it was lost. Lost when I crashed on this accursed island long ago. A guardian genie is always on duty. I'll return your doll to you. You certainly seem like an honest one. Take this. Oh, a fusion stone. Awesome. A fusion stone! It is the only thing of value I've managed to hold on to. Return my scary doll, and I will help you find your friends. Aw, oh, that is awesome. Well, since we have a fusion stone, we can now go and ask Zappel for help. So let's head back to Armor Town. And go talk to Zapple. Oh, more stuff in here? Handy. You're as resourceful as they say. That's a fusion stone, all right. There's something about it, though. Hmm. A stranger entrusted this to you, didn't they? Meanwhile, I... Look, I'm sorry I doubted you. If Plank and Vera trust you, then so do I. You can borrow my magic, too. Ready to combine our magic? Yes, please. Better brace yourself. You're in for a shock. And now we have the spark dance. You like dancing. Our powers have combined. Your dance magic and my spark magic. You're sure to get a charge out of that. I'm ready. You can count on me. The spark dance can activate machinery or shock metal. While dancing, press left to activate the magic. Why not test the spark dance in this room? I'll give it a shot. After all, how can I refuse? <laughs> I don't get it. Never mind. <laughs> I give Shantae tr uh, me forever. And there we go. These little electric panels here we can activate with spark magic. And that leaves us open to a lot of things now. Especially collecting things. So, let's head out of Armor Town and go take a look around. Seems dolls are disappearing left, right, and center here. Alrighty. We have lots to do now. I love the electric eel look they give Shantae here. I didn't notice the sand earlier, but it does appear to have what we're needing, some ore. All right. Can I do anything in here now? I don't think so. 
wrong button. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. I'm gonna need something special here, I think. Oh wow, I actually took him out. Alright, something hidden here apparently. Ooh, lots of goodies. Alright. Let's see, where's our next spot? Uh, let's go down first, it looks like it's a little bit closer. Whee. I'd rather get the ore. What? What's this thing? Oh, it's busted? Well, with the nuts and bolts I got, I should be able to fix it. Shonda had to know a little technical know-how from her uncle. Alright. And I don't have enough magic. Oh, great. I need to restore some magic. The electric dance actually takes up a lot of magic, believe it or not. I'm nowhere close to anywhere that has... Hmm. I guess I have to go back to town for a moment. Oh, it'll be nice when I get some magic regen of some sort. And yes, it does exist. I'll wait till it turns around. Kinda hoping you would've dropped magic instead of money this time. Well, we're not too far from town at least. Whee! Alright, back with magic. <laughs> I went to hit the jump button and nothing happened. I'll wait till you turn around. Being able to rabbit that fast is pretty handy. Alright, let's go back to the one I was originally at. And get some magic going. Spark Dance apparently does some AoE damage as well, which is why it's so powerful in magic consumption. Two out of three, just one more. Hopefully this one's not broken either. I'll check it first, just to be on the safe side. Wait, did that say a new symbol when I... No, it was just a, a circle. That would've been kind of nifty if that was a visual effect. Just out of power, okay. There we go! That's all the ore we need. So we have a lot of things to find now. I can't really... Link showed up here, though. Let's see. Oh, just that. Okay. Well, where are we closer to? Oh, we're about halfway between each. This way will be faster, though. Off we go. Because the warp room's just right here. Back to Armor Town. Alrighty. Let's go talk to Armor Baron. The first. Just in case. What can I say? I'm suspicious. This is Armor Baron we're talking about. The Barons haven't really been the most honest people with us. No? There we go. You've done it! Are these ore chunks for me? Splendid! Three ore chunks, just as I asked. As and such robust specimens! There's enough here to make two sets of armor. 
I will craft armor for you. And also... Uh, what? Oh. And also, Ultima... Uh, Ultima. Ultimate Extreme Power Unleashed Unauthorized Warbird Trainer Armor for Sky as well. Armor for me? Yes. It will be light enough for me to fly on birdback? Mm -hmm. So light. I'm in. Allow me. Then step right up, ladies, and let my fashion for forge word forgers take over. Whoa! Ultimate Extreme Powers Unleashed Unauthorized Body Armor! Actually, it has more layers than your usual attire. Hey! Yeah, but not very much of it. <laughs> Fret not. You have my personal guarantee that this armor will keep you in mint condition. What? Yeah, what gives? This armor is fused into one solid piece! Mint condition. What? What is this? Stop messing around, armor baron! I'm sorry, ladies, but I have a top tier collector arriving very shortly. And he's only interested in collectibles that are in mint condition. You ladies will need to remain on the card. Oh. For all time! <laughs> this jerk is... I think that's a typo. This jerk is a vile monster just like his brother! Even worse! He's a toy reseller! So long, ladies. See you in the collector's catalog. Sky, wake up! <sighs> We've been moved. Where are we? Shush! Someone's coming. Squid Baron! Uh, he's becoming troublesome. Oh boy, oh boy. I sure scored some big this time. These cigs have never been in on the peg. No yellowing on the blister pack. And look, the blonde one's face looks scurry like a factory defect. It's gotta be worth millions on the collector's market. Not that I'd sell it. Then again, I need to fund my video game somehow. Squid Baron. Whoa, it talked. Wait, these gals are battery operated, which can only mean corrosion cometh. I must open the package just to make sure. But no, I mustn't! Ugh. The chig is up, Squid Baron. Aww. Yeah, just let us out of here. Crumbs, it won't stop talking. I know. I'll contact the manufacturer. We'll just make it their problem. Let's see. There should be a manufacturer stamp right on the old caboose. <laughs> hey, back off, creep! Ugh. Yeah, we're gonna be part of... We're not going to be part of your man doll collection. D d dolls? How dare you? These aren't dolls, they're action figures. Pop culture collectibles. Articulated works of art suitable for display. You can t call them whatever you want. Just let us out. Look, you're obviously bootlegs and therefore inferior models. Vile peg warmer! You'll be sorry when I flip this collection for big bucks! Oh please, you won't sell this stuff! It's an investment! I'm only doing this to fund my own game! I told you! I will be an epic adventurer starring me! It will be a lot like your adventures, only way cooler! Everything will be aquatic themed! Aquatic locations, aquatic transformations, aquatic bosses! And then, as you reach the end, there's a huge squid boss. A boss to end all bosses! Is that all? Of course 
that's not all. There will also be a radical hot babe just chilling out on his liquid brain like, hey baby. Players will be so distracted they'll forget how to fight. Who came up with that? Me! I did! I am the awesome boss! No one cares about the hero because the boss is so just mind-blowingly awesome! <sighs> You okay? I'm fine. Just gotta go lie down. Don't go nowhere. I think we hit a nerve. He's gone. Now's our chance. Huh? What's that sound? Oh, it's you. You're that one from before. Hey, come back. Who was she? I don't know. But this isn't the first time I've seen her. Whoever she is, she seems to be on our side. Come on. Huh? Where are we going? You find those missing girls. I'm going to be armor baron with his own armor. <laughs> oh! You pissed off Sky. Wrong person to piss off. <laughs> oh. Catch you topside. That. <laughs> okay, that was kind of funny. And I actually had fun acting Squid Bear in there. He got really upset. Guess that's what you get for being a classic nerd, eh? Oh, the Scream's boss room if I ever saw it. Intruder alert! Women in the man cave! Security! Stop them before they break my stuff! Oh, fitting. There, take it slow. That's a better way to do it. Oh! A drool stained it all. Someone was missing this. And what's over here? A nugget. Handy. Alright, what am I doing now? I guess getting dolls back to people. Well, let's see what I can find. Wait. Why did it reflect on the slimes? That was interesting. Looks like there's something in here, too. Huh. Okay. I kinda wanna see how far I can go first. There's probably a bunch of hidden stuff I just can't quite get yet. So we'll just look around. That looks like I reconnected here. Well, since we have a drill area, let's go take a look there. I won't worry about this now. Ow. Let's go look around. Ooh! Chest. For another nugget. Handy, handy. How many do I have now? Do I have enough? No. Well, I just need a few more. Nothing I can do here, apparently. Yeah, nothing I can do right now. Okay, well, we took a look, so let's, uh... Let's go back to Armor Town and give the Drool Stain doll. I get the feeling we're gonna go through a trade quest here. I'm curious of something. What if I get these guys as close together as possible? Never mind. Since they just want to hop around all over. They don't do too much damage, which is nice. That HP reducer has been helpful too.
All right. Um, there should be a warp point not too far from here. Yeah, just a little higher up. Ah. Well, at least I got a heart back. Now oh, it's over here. All right. Let's go see what we can do. All right. Well, first things first, we're gonna heal up and regain our magic. Now, who was looking for the drool stain doll? No, nope, you were looking for the rugged one. You were looking for the brand son. I hate the fact that the B button doesn't cancel out! Way forward, you're better than this! Were you looking for this one? Yes, okay. Great, let's take a look at it. And that's my jewel stained doll, right? It's even still wet, ew. I'm kind of a heavy sleeper. Here. I found this muscle man toy earlier. Oh, it's the brand son. Well, at least the trade quest is in town! Yep, here's your grandson doll. The manly doll. Oh, he's cute! You were looking for the manly doll, weren't you? Yes! Hmm. <laughs> And the scary doll. See, this is how you handle a trade quest. You keep it compact and don't have you running all over the map for it. Wayford gets it right. <laughs> Alright, now that that's done, let's head back. This should actually be the next siren den, thinking about it. Here's your doll, ma'am. Oh, what's this? You found my scary doll. I see that the half-genie daughter follows in the footsteps of her genie mother. When the genies went away, I harbored much fear for this world. But now that I've met you... Yes, I see. Perhaps one day the half-genies can turn these evil tides. Now then, beyond this door lies the great boiler room. It is the lair of the truly vile siren who lurks in the dark. She sunk my ship. Fed on my crew. All I could do was watch, helpless and without form. You must summon your courage, for the siren's lair is haunted. Yeah, this is it. And, uh, her appearance looks a little familiar, doesn't it? At least, hair wise. I always made the assumption that that actually might be Risky's mother. But, I think with all this side questing and the fact that my throat's so dry that I'm probably gonna lose my voice later, I'm gonna go back to the save point and call this an episode. Wait a minute. Oh, okay, it's not too far. There. Probably save point inside, but eh, I'll take my chances out here. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Let's Play Shantae and the Seven Sirens. This is Autumn Child saying I'll see you all next time.